Hello, my name is Robert Clark, and welcome to show three of Omnitech News. Today, we're going to be doing a review of the Microsoft Arc mouse and the 120 gigabyte Zoom. So let's get started with those two reviews. Now, as you may know, I am a big Microsoft fan geek, so um, of course I have a lot of Microsoft products. You see right here, Arc mouse, 120 gigabyte Zoom. So the Arc mouse. It, I was a bit skeptical at first when I got this because I, I tried it out. It wasn't really that great, so I was I was gonna be like, uh, maybe I should take this back. Well, after a few weeks of trying this out, I really do love this mouse. It is one of the best mouses I've ever owned. I would definitely recommend it uh, to someone who likes a foldable, quick little mouse they can put in their like briefcase on their way to work. Because this is very, very slim, as you can see here, and it just easily folds up, extremely light. One downer is it does take AA battery, I mean AAA batteries, as you see right here, which isn't really that great considering this is about $60, $50. Um, so that's one downer. You can get this in red or the black version, and they, they, they're pretty good products. They're very solid. Uh, they feel quite nice in your hand, so yeah, they're pretty nice products. If I was giving this a rating, I would give it about a 4 out of 5 stars. It's not quite there in my opinion, they should have added a rechargeable battery considering a lot of the uh, high quality mouse these days have docks and all kinds of crazy power sources. Um, so I think if they were doing a second model of this, like a, a version 2, I would definitely recommend that they put a battery pack in it that's rechargeable. Luckily, I do have rechargeable AA batteries, so it's not that big of a deal. So, But it's, I don't know, kind of skeptical about it. But for all of, overall, very, very nice product, product, very small, very light, very, very elegant. I mean, look at that. It looks really nice. Um, and then the USB is just a tiny little little device, which is just super small. Um, it's unbelievably small, and it just docks right in there. And then it comes with a carrying case, which is just a small little sleeve. But overall, very nice product, 4 out of 5 stars, and that's the Arc mouse from Microsoft. So the Microsoft Zune is what you'd expect out of something like an iPod. It is the same kind of device in context that it has music videos pictures this one has a radio and um you've got a marketplace and a couple of games so if you're actually comparing all the features the zune is better than the ipod i'm sorry but they're exactly the same price and everything but it has things like social where you can send each other um songs and pictures and videos all that, and then it has a marketplace built in. I know the iPod Touch has that, but that's that isn't the same as this. This is the iPod Classic. This would be a um, a comparison versus the iPod Classic. But you you've got every, it does everything on to to some degree. I mean, pictures. You've got playlists, um, songs, of course. Uh, you've also got albums. Uh, um, artists, all all the things you'd expect. Videos, got the options of looking them in TV shows, movies. All it's it's classic what you'd get on something like an iPod. So it's not better in those things, but it's better because it has the social, and you can actually download songs wherever, and you can actually sync wirelessly to your computer, um, which is pretty neat, and I love the Zoom card feature, so if you listen to a song, sync it up with your computer, then everyone can see what you've been listening to, which is, which may be good for some people, or not, not quite sure if that's good or not, but it comes in a really nice small little case, um, it's a good device, I mean, I mean, I don't see what's wrong with it. Everyone thinks it's so crap and everything, but I really don't see what's that bad about it. So, you've got your classic video, it can hold tons and tons of content, and it, it's fine. I mean, if, you, if you're if you a Microsoft user, if you're a Windows user, then I definitely recommend getting one of these, because the Zoom software works really well, and I have an iPod Touch, and I just think this device is better than it for the price and everything. So the Zune, I would give it three stars because it's a solid device, but it doesn't really bring that much to you. It's better than the iPod, but 
they could have done a bit more of it as it has wireless and you've got the options of games. I think they're going to put something in that in the future, but um, they haven't done anything yet. They should really, because it can play games quite well. Like It's got Hexic, just Sudoku, just some games that you will just play on the go, but it's not that sort of killer. I think they could have done a bit more with it, but it's a solid device in, in, in all. So thank you for watching show through of Omnitech News. I hope you've enjoyed the reviews of the 120 gigabyte Zune and the Microsoft Arc Mouse, both Microsoft pro products, obviously. You may have been noticing we haven't got our site up running, but we're almost done. So expect omnitechnews.net to be ready very soon. Keep checking it out. Um, we're going to try and get a blog on that and everything, but it's kind of difficult because we're actually building this in HTML, so it's a bit harder than your average website. So we'll be we'll keep we'll keep trying to do this, and we'll we'll hope you get we we'll hope we get our site up running soon. So just keep keep looking, and I think it'll be worth the while. But we're also sorry for delaying these shows. We just we haven't been keeping up with them. We know we should have like. Clark HQ Tech, we did a bit more on that, but we're really trying hard to do this. It's just kind of difficult with school and everything. So just keep looking and just up, subscribe to our channel and just check out all our stuff. And hopefully this will be turn out to be quite a good web show.